SF2 Zelda here with some more Legend of Zelda. In the last part, we stuff. Hmm. Let's just say we we killed some, we bombed some Dodongos. Hmm. Isn't this just an alternate version of where we were just at? A key. Out we go there. Come on, get in. Link! Not again. It's a good thing I still have that potion. Or else right now, I'd be dead like I was, like I might have been at the Lionel's. Lionels. Oh god, they're so tough. I think they're like a common dungeon enemy or something later. I mean, enemy in a dungeon or something later. Ah, here's the true item. It's a whistle? What the heck is a whistle used for? Tell the truth, it's for warping you to dungeons. So if you want to get some rupee hunting, this item is actually pretty good. Because then, you can just hunt the rupees easy. Because you can go to a dungeon, you can keep warping until you get to a dungeon that you think will have sufficient rupees. I like dungeon one. I mean, easy enemies, good rupees. Good rupees. Yep. It's also used to, guess what, beat the boss. Ooga booga, ooga booga. Now, where in Hyrule is the dungeon compass? By Nehru Din Furor, I banish thee from our world, you under things. Do not worry, I know what I'm doing. I hope. <laughs> this way, people. To a winter wonderland. So wonderful and... You know, this looks like it's poking out, waiting this thing. Bomb me, bomb. Bomb me. Bomb me. And it lies. I'll be showing you a very useful old man in this dungeon once I beat Dig Dogger, the boss of the dungeon. Oh, I should get out the candle. Dark nuts. No. Yay. For magical sword. Hooray for magical sword. We got the compass. I think it works here. Please, no. I think I'll end off this episode for now.